hey guys welcome back to my channel so today I'm going to be doing a updated makeup collection slash storage video this was requested on my previous video not my previous video my other video that I did ask you guys if you guys wanted to see my makeup updated makeup collection and some of you did say yes here it is um quick disclaimer th these are my favorite videos to watch on youtube like to be honest even though i feel like a lot of people have too much makeup but i love these type of videos these are my favorite videos to watch i'm not trying to brag whatsoever i feel like everybody has to say this i am a beauty blogger i'm a youtuber and makeup is my hobby this is what i like to collect i've been collecting makeup since before i started youtube most of the stuff that i have is half drugstore to be honest and i have a little bit of high end I don't buy that much high-end makeup just because I feel like there's so much out there at the drugstore better than high-end if you guys know what I mean so yeah I'm not trying to brag whatsoever this was highly requested so I hope you guys enjoy this video thank you guys so so much for watching don't forget to like this video if you guys enjoyed it also if you're new to my channel don't forget to subscribe if you have anything else to say and I'll see you guys in my next one bye guys Okay guys, this is what you see for the back of my videos. This is the second time I try to record this by the way. Just because I was recording it with my tripod and to be honest, I didn't like the quality so I'm just holding the camera. So if it's a little bit shaky, I'm so sorry but I'm trying my best not to be that shaky. Um, if you guys were wondering where I got these frames from, I got them from Marshalls. First one says be brave, the other one um, it has sleeves on it. I thought it was really cute together. And the bottom one it says peace, um, happiness. If you guys see my makeup collection before, um, the furniture wise hasn't changed at all. Everything furniture wise is from Ikea. So like the table is from Ikea, the Alex 5 drawer is from Ikea. And the mirror and the light bulbs are also from Ikea. I'll leave everything furniture wise in the bottom bar. So you guys can check that out. And then the light bulbs, I got it from Lowe's. Okay, starting right over here, I have the makeup that I use every single time and I alternate makeup every time as well. Um, on top right here, I have the NYX Highlight and Contour Palette. This is my C palette. I have my Benefit Box Blushes that I depotted. On the side, I have my L'Oreal Makeup Setting Spray. Then I have my Dirty Beauty Blender, which I used before this video. And then I have the lipstick that I'm wearing. This is the Revlon Color Burst Matte Lip Balm in Sultry. This acrylic organizer, I got it from TJ Maxx for like 20 bucks. In this first drawer, I have my foundations, concealers, primers, stuff that I use every single day. Um, I have my Maybelline Fit Me foundation. I have my NARS Pure Tinted Moisturizer. I have the new Ma Maybelline Better Skin Concealer. I have the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. And I have the Smashbox Primer. In this drawer, I keep powders, blushes, and highlighters that I use every single day. Um, let's see, I have NARS, I have Tarte, I have um, NYX, I have ELF, I have my Estee Lauder Brown Shimmer, which is my favorite one, and then I have my Makeup Forever HD Powder. Okay, right down here, I have all my Bella eyeshadow from Milani that I use often. And then I also have four ColourPop Shock Shadows, which I really, really like. Then I also have the e.l.f. High Definition Setting Powder. Setting powder. I don't know why that's in there. It should be up here, but it's there. And then I have my Milani Eyeshadow Primer. In this bottom drawer, it's kind of messy, but it's kind of like organized in my mindset. I keep um, lipsticks that I wear often, lip, um, lip pencils, mascaras, eyebrow pencils, eyeliners, and all that jazz. Right over here, I have my brushes. This one right here holds my face brushes. And right over here, I have my eye brushes. And then I have this brush right here, which um, doesn't fit in there just because it's not in a brush form. It's kind of like, you know, um, it has a weird form to it. So like, I just have it right there. And then I have a flower right here, which is fake. Most of my brushes are Real Technique brushes, Coastal Scent, um, BH Cosmetics, um, Sonia Kashuk. Pretty affordable brushes. The cup holders, if you guys were wondering, I got it from Ikea as well. I'll leave that in the bottom bar for you guys. 
Okay guys, in this first drawer I have foundations, BB creams, concealers, and primers. And then I also have some setting sprays right over here. I have this brush that I got from e.l.f. Um, I don't know why, it's, why that's in there. It should be up there, but to be honest, I don't know why it's in there. Um, and then I have a dirty beauty sponge. This is from Beauty Techniques. Um, it's really dirty. I don't know why is it dirty. It shouldn't be in here if it's dirty, but it's in there. Right over here, I have foundations that are either too light for me right now or too dark. This is the Tarte Amazonian Clay Foundation. I have CoverGirl Outlast. I have the L'Oreal True Match Lumi. I have the Maybelline um, Dream, Dream Wonder Foundation. I have the L'Oreal True Match. I have the Maybelline better skin foundation and then I have the elf flawless foundation right over here I have all my BB creams I have some from Olay I have the Garnier BB cream which is my favorite one um, I have one from Ame I believe yeah this is Ame and this is Maybelline the pure BB BB cream um, and then I have that little one over here is from Pacifica if I'm not sure okay yeah this is from Pacifica. Oh, I forgot to tell you guys. If you guys were wondering where I got these containers from, I got them from the Dollar Tree for like a dollar. So like every organizer that I have in these drawers were a dollar. Right over here, I have my MAC um, Fix Plus and I also have my e.l.f. Makeup Mist and Set. Right over here, I have my concealers which are a little bit too light for me right now. I used to use these a lot in the winter, like last year. Um, I have the Maybelline um, Master Conceal. I have the Benefit Boyden Concealer. I have the Elf Concealer that I don't like. I have a, what is it called? A Boo Boo Cover Up Concealer that I got in my Ipsy bag, which is really, really good, but it's really light for my skin. Um, I have the Maybelline Age Rewind, which I got the wrong color, and this is brand new. I got this brand new, and I got the light medium color, I believe. No, I got the light pale color, like seriously. Um, so I have that there. I have the Francisian Formula Concealer. This is also too light for me right now. Um, then I have the Hard Candy Camouflage Concealer, which is like super duper Full coverage. If you're looking for full coverage, try to use this one. That's too much for my under eyes. Um, and then I have the NYX HD Concealer, which is brand new. Um, I had another one that I didn't like, so that's why this one is in there. And then in the back right here, I have all my face primers. I have the a NYX Angel Veil, which I like. I have the e.l.f. Um, hydration face primer. I have this setting spray that I got in my Ipsy bag and I still have a little bit in there. I don't want to throw it away because it's my favorite, favorite one. I have a Smashbox Photo Finish Primer, which I haven't opened yet because I have uh, so many primers to go through. Um, I have the Maybelline Master Prime Primer. I have the Maybelline Baby Skin Primer. And I think I have another Pixie Primer over there. Yes, and then I have an Urban Decay Primer down there that I don't like so yeah those are all my primers okay in this drawer I have my powders blushes bronzers cream blushes and stuff like that and highlighters over here so mainly this drawer is powders blushes bronzers and cream blushes right over here I have all my powders I have the Rimmel Stay My Powder which is my favorite one I have this Be A Bombshell setting powder which is a little bit messy i haven't opened that i have my air spun powder i have my Maybelline fit me powder which i really like i have my cover fx powder which is too dark for me and i have my studio fix powder from mac right over here i have mainly my blushes i have right here a little small one from nars this is the nars orgasm like I said, I used to love this back in the day, so that's why I got a little small one. Um, I have three NYX blushes right here. This one is a cream blush. These three are from Milani. This is Milani Dolce Pink, I believe. And this is Milani Luminoso. Um, and this is the Milani Old Packaging. My dad got this for me. 
Right here, I have my only Physicians Formula blush. I have a Pixi bronzer just because it doesn't fit anywhere else. So I have it right there, which is too dark for me. That's why it's right there. Um, I have an e.l.f. blush, which is super, super bright. So that's a pretty nice color. Um, and then I have an All May Wake Me Up blush, which I really, really like the color. I do not know why I don't use this that often. It's really, really nice. I like it. Okay, right next to that right here, I have bronzers and little palette duos, um, e.l.f. duos and stuff like that. Um, right here, I have this blush that I found at Marshalls, which it, it acts like a highlighter, so that's why I have it right there. I have my um, Naked Flush palette. I have my NYX NYC bronzer, which I used to love this back in the day. I have the Tarte bronzer that I got in my Ipsy bag last month, I think. Right here, I have all of my e.l.f. duos right here, and then these are the new e.l.f. palettes. This is what it looks like. This is the light version, and right over here, I have the darker version. Right over here, I have more blushes, so I have three Milani powder blushes. Um, I have Tea Rose, Coral Cove, and then I have Warm Petals. So those are those, and then I have two more of the Tarte um, blushes. I got these um, last year during Christmas season. Um, right here I have a model cold blush. Right over here I have three blushes from e.l.f. And then I have the Lorac, the Lorac tantalizer which is bronzer and a highlighter. Okay, right in this corner I have the Ulta sculpting palette which I showed in one of my videos I believe. Which I like, really like that bronzer. Here I have my BH um, Cosmetics Blush Duo, and then I have the other e.l.f. blush. This is the darker version of this one right here. Okay, right in the back right here, I have my highlighters and cream blushes. This is a gorgeous highlighter, which I haven't even opened. I have the Chella highlighter. I have the... This is Elizabeth Moth Tint Sass, which is for your lips and your cheeks. I have the e.l.f. shimmers, which I heard so many good things about them, so that's why I picked it up. I got these recently. Right in the back, I have a Clinique stick blush and then a Be A Bombshell um, little stick blush back there. Now onto my favorite, favorite drawer. <laughs> these are all my lipsticks and lip glosses and lip balms and lippy sticks and stuff like that. Um, I have all my Estee Lauder lipsticks. I have two Revlons. I have Wet n Wild. I have the Fergie lipsticks. I have NYX. This is a Color Whisper, I believe, from Revlon. I have an NYC lipstick that I got in an influencer box. Right here, I have my only MAC lipsticks. This is Ruby Woo. This is my favorite one for the winter. Um, I have an Urban Decay little sample. I have Makeup Forever. I have Bare Minerals. I have all my e.l.f. lipsticks right here. And then I have a little sample of a lipstick that I got in my Ipsy bag that I don't know how to pronounce the name. Right over here, I have all my Milani color statement lipsticks and my matte lipsticks. I think I have two more in my purse to be honest. Right over here I have the Maybelline matte lipsticks. I think these are the newer ones that they came out with. I should have these upside down. These are my favorite, favorite from Maybelline. Maybelline Color Whisper and I have a Maybelline um, Vivid lipstick, which is a bright pink color, which I love that one a lot. I have a JCap Beauty lipstick. It dries matte. It's like a lips. Uh, it's like a lip gloss, but it dries matte like a lipstick. So that's why I have it there. And then I have a Rimmel um, Cake Moss lipstick, which is a pretty nude color. Right over here, I have my new Milani Amour matte lip colors. Yeah, I have six of them. They're not my favorite. I tried them on and I try to love them, but I don't like them, to be honest. They're too drying and really, really hard to get off. But um, this one is my favorite color. That's really pretty. 
um, in this one. But they're really, really hard to get off and super drying on my lips. So that's why they're there. I did try it on on my lips. If not, I'll give it away to somebody. But right over here, I have all my lip glosses. Um, I have LA Girl. I have a lot of LA Girl. Um, I have the NYX Butter Glosses, which they're all in the bottom are NYX Butter Glosses. Um, I have this really nice, pretty color um, cargo lip gloss. I love lip gloss. This is so pretty. Um, I have a Calvin Klein little sample lip gloss. I have Revlon. I have the Milani lip gloss. These are my favorite one as well. Right in the back, I have lipsticks, lipsticks in a lip pencil form. So I, I have a lot of um, ColourPop lippy sticks. This is the L'Oreal um, Le Matte lipstick. So like I said, I have a lot of ColourPop. I have um, CoverGirl. I have Pop Beauty. Um, I have lip pencils. I have J Gap Beauty. I have the Fergie um, from the Wet n Wild Fergie line collection. Right in the back, I have all my lip balms. I have two baby lips. I have one from NYX. I have this lip treatment, which I love. I love this so much when my lips are really chapped in the winter. Um, I have this lip balm that I got in my Ipsy bag and it smells amazing. I have a Be A Bombshell lip balm. I have my EOS lip balm right here. And then I have a Nivea lip butter right there. Second to last drawer. This is kind of organized in my way. These are cream eyeshadows, single shadows, palettes, mascaras, eyeliner, and all that jazz. Right over here, I just keep my, my cream eyeshadows. I have two from the color tattoos from Maybelline. I have one from Bobbi Brown right here. I have two of the L'Oreal Infallible um, Little Shadows, which I like. Um, I have the NYX eyeshadow base, I believe. This, I have the e.l.f. Lustrous Eyeshadow, which is a pretty, pretty pink color. I love this. Um, and then I have a pixie stick shadow, which I do not know how to use this. Then I have a gel eyeliner, I believe. Yes, I have a dark blue gel eyeliner. Then I have a duo lash glue. I have a little pen crayon shadow. And then I have the backups of my eyelash curler. So I have that right there. Next to that, I have all my mascaras. The ones that I'm using and eyeliners. So I have Elf, I have one from Ulta that I haven't opened yet, I have Rimmel, I have Pixie, I have eyeliners, I have Tarte, I have the L'Oreal eyeliner, which I tried this on a, in a video and I don't like this eyeliner. Um, so yeah, I have that there. And then the rest of the stuff is just eyeliner, stuff that I don't use because I don't use eyeliner in my waterline, so yeah. Next to that, I have my Unique Mascara, which I use only when I go out. Right over here, I have backups of mascaras that I want to use. Um, I have this one that I got recently in my haul video. I want to try this out so bad, but I have other ones that I have to go through first. Um, and then I have my Rimmel Eyeliner, which I have to open because I have to throw the other one away, so I don't know why that's in there. Right over here, I have... My single eyeshadows, my trio eyeshadows, and stuff like that. All these right here in the corner are all from Maybelline. And trio eyeshadows and the quads. I have two from Pacifica. These are really pretty. I get these in my Ipsy bag. Right here I have two NYX eyeshadows. And then I have a Bella, like a shimmery shadow. I have an e.l.f. fake eyeshadow, which I really, really like this one. I have this single eyeshadow from Elizabeth Moth. So I have two of those. And I have a Maybelline Studio eyeshadow duo. Over here, I have a NYX Trio. I have a NYX Cake Powder. This is for um, my eyebrows. I used to use this a lot, if you guys can see. In the bottom, I have a Pop Beauty Trio. Right in the back, I have all my palettes and little small palettes. I have the Maybelline The Nudes palette, which I like. I have a NYX palette right here. I have the Elf Prim eyeshadow palette, which I love. 
I have this palette right here that I got from Marshalls, which the pigmentation on these are really nice. And I have a Jessie's Girl little palette right here. Okay, right in the back are my bigger palettes. I have this 22 eyeshadow palette from BH. I have this palette. It's a blush palette from a company I forgot the name of. But I haven't opened that just because I have a lot of blushes to go through. So these are matte blushes. Um, I have my BH Galaxy Cheek Palette. I have my BH uh, on the 60s palette. I have these palettes that I got a long time ago. I've been wanting to depot these, but they're super, super messy. Um, so I need to get a C palette to depot those. And then I have the NYX Wicked Dreams palette, which I don't use that often and I should. So yeah, those are all my palettes. Okay, and this last drawer is basically miscellaneous and a stuff that I have backup stuff. I have stuff that I need to open and use. I have these eyelashes, which I really, really like, and I need to try these on. These are from Kiss, and they're number three. I really, really like them just because they look very natural. So I have that. I have a Rimmel makeup remover right there. I have the um, Urban Decay Precision Mascara, which I haven't even opened. I have an Ardell, um eyelashes these are demi wispies i have a little brush set right there which is good for traveling right over here i have my backups and samples all these are samples and products that i haven't even opened yet right in this corner over here i have stuff that i haven't even opened yet i have mascaras i have eyeliners i have eyeshadows i have a lot of stuff that I haven't even go gone through just because I have to go through a lot of stuff before I open these. So I haven't even opened those. And then in the back I have a gift that I think, I can't remember where I got this from. But somebody gave this to me for I think Christmas I believe. Um, so I have that back there. I haven't even opened it because like I said I do have a lot of stuff to go through. Right over here I have skincare items that I get in my Ipsy bag. I have exfoliators, I have lotions, I have primers, I have um, setting sprays, I have tanning lotion which I, I don't need because I tan by myself. So I have moisturizers, I have airbrush legs from Sally Hansen and stuff like that. And then I also have these up and up wedge things that I just put in here. Okay, I forgot to tell you guys that this is a talk to video. I got a lot of good feedback from my other talk to videos, so I decided to do these more often. Anyways, I am going to start off with a primer. This is the Maybelline Master Prime by Face Studio Primer. For foundation, we're going to use the Maybelline Fit Me Dewy Foundation. It has SPF of 18 and minus for normal to dry skin. I got mine in three tons. 310 sun beige okay now for concealer i'm going to be using the maybelline superstay better skin concealer 